All right, guys, just wanted to give an update of where we're at on the, uh, the 65 Cobra, the, or Red Cobra. Um, I'll start with the brake system. So we had on the rear wheels here, we got the Willwoods installed, um, and along with that came uh, new e-brake uh, mounts and everything. So all that's basically everything but the hub is new. Um, so you can see we've got the braided line going into the calipers. We have got, uh, it's maybe a little, maybe it'll be easier to see on this side. There we go. We've got the, the cables going back into the brakes. And you can see this was one of the things. Get the uh, adapters. You're not gonna move it. You're gonna be able to see it now, but on the, it's just a. Uh, there's a little stop on the end of that cable to, to adapt them to these brakes, which are still Woolwood e brakes. Uh, we had to buy that adapter there. Uh, but there's a good look at the bracketry and the caliper on the left rear here. Um, coming forward. There's our e-brake cables. And then on the front here, what you end up doing on these is, you can kind of see it there, is you end up cutting off about half of the uh, spindle to mount the um, caliper mounts. Other than that, pretty straightforward, and these hoses went straight into the stock hard lines. Uh, let's see. Let's see the little wood on the caliper there. There was some assembly required on the rotors. Uh, those are like a three-piece rotor, I think it was. Um, and then the other piece with the brakes was the, let's see if we can get a good look at the master cylinder here. Master cylinder's up there, and uh, you can see the two front lines coming out of that. Those are going to the distribution of the brakes. Um, that rear line going in, that's the hydro assist. So if we follow that on back around everything up tucked to the frame here. We're still in progress, actually. I'll get to it in a minute, but there's a return line dangling right there for the moment. But uh, so we put our hydro assist line in, and the best spot that I could find to install this hydro assist uh, was back here by the gas tank. I didn't, you know, I wanted away from heat and stuff, not sitting there right by exhaust headers and whatnot. And there's just, on these Cobras, there's, you know, they're basically an engine and a transmission and some wheels. There's not much to them. Um, so we came back here and mounted it on the frame for the gas tank. Um, and then, uh, you know, ran a relay and everything and a fuse. And uh, so that, that hydraulic pump there uh, is what gives you your hydro assist. So this thing's got nice tight brakes now. You know, there's probably an inch of pedal travel and it's hard as a rock. And then you can probably move that with your... Uh, little toe uh, with this hydro assist turned on so uh, should be some pretty nice brakes for this guy. Oh well, I've forgotten too we got the reservoir mounted and tucked away back in there that has to be higher than both the master and the, like, the hydro pump that was in the back uh, that supplies both those uh, and then there's the master from the top view again the front two lines go out to distribution that rear line uh, there's a hard line we ran up for the uh, hydro assist.